I just want to quickly show you how you can um, mute um, Discord. Um, so one of the main benefits, as we previously discussed, of using Discord um, is that it's a separate tool for a, our, our work communication. Um, so during your, your off days or your downtimes or vacations, you're going to be wanting to probably use WhatsApp um, to be um, you know, running your personal life. Um, but it's healthy for you to be able to share, separate your personal and professional. Um, so by using a different tool for professional communication, we're actually going to be able to, to mute that um, on our off days, after work, um, um, and so on. Um, to, do, to do so is quite simple. You can just go to your little uh, avatar here. You can just go to your status, and you can just like set your status to do not disturb, and that's on the desktop client, and you won't be bothered. Um, when you do want to come back onto the desktop, desktop client, you can simply go back to your avatar and then make yourself online. Um, doing it on uh, doing it on mobile um, is um, is equally easy. Uh, but please give me a moment while my mobile device mirrors. Ah, here we go. Okay, so um, in here you can go to. Uh, this is the Discord app. Um, so here you've got all of your, you know, various chats and whatnot. Um, uh, at the top, you'll see Parts and Labor Hospitality, and you'll see these three little dots. Just click the three little dots, right? Um, and then go to Notifications, and then go to uh, Mute, right? And then so then you can say I want to mute it for you know, eight hours because I'm, you know, in between shifts or I might want to move it, remove, mute myself for 24 hours because I'm, you know, it's my off day, you know, or, or I can just like decide to turn it back on later um, and so on. And if you do that, um, you will um, still be able to use your um, uh, personal communication of WhatsApp, but then um, Discord uh, will not be bothering you. All right, that's all. Thank you very much. Cheers.